Hello Cup Coders and welcome back to Surviving Ars Magica. How you doing today? I'm your host, Magus96. Let's get on with the show, shall we? Alright. Uh, just a reminder, there won't be any videos next week or the week after December 10th. Um, next week is Thanksgiving and... Well, actually, this week is Thanksgiving, and so we'll be leaving this town for this Wednesday. And we'll be coming back next Sunday. So I won't be here on the weekend to record. So there won't be any videos next week. Mm -hmm. um, the following weekend there will be videos. Weekend after that there won't be any videos because I'm trying. I'll be participating in Ludum Dare to see if I can make a game in 48 hours. Oh. I'm not sure if I can, but we're going to give it a try. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, um, I'm going to go ahead and let you know that there may be some changes coming. I don't know. It's out of my hands at this point. Um, by that, what I mean is I have been in interviewing for a potential new job. Um, it is it's a bump in my income, a substantial bump in my income if I get the job. Uh, so... Some of the things that if it if I get this if I do land this new job, then some of the things that you can expect to see happen in the next year. Uh, one of them obviously is I will be getting. Oh, I wouldn't say obviously, but one of the things that would change is I will be I would be getting a new computer definitely. Um, we'll also be moving to North Carolina, um, which and that's kind of moving to North Carolina is going to happen, whether I get the job or not. I just want to point that out and say it like it's done with like our entire family has moved to North Carolina and we need we need to go to because they're family you know I mean the the major thing is you know I've got so many kids it, it's very important to me and my wife for us to be where the family is because it's kind of like a safety net like if something bad were to happen we have family we would then have family near us to help us out if something bad happens. Whereas right now, we don't have that much family near us. I mean, her mom and dad have moved to North Carolina. Her sister has been living there most of her life. Um, her brother is here, but we don't really hang out all that much. And beyond that, we don't have a whole lot of other family here. And of course, all my family is in Maryland. So yeah, go, go figure that one. So that's kind of one of the things is, you know, we are definitely planning on moving to North Carolina next at the end of this year. Not the end of this year, but I'd say next summer we're, we're planning to move. So whether I get this new job or not, we are def we're still planning on moving to North Carolina. Uh, this new job would just make that so much easier. Oh, my God. Like, you just don't, don't know. Um, well, because one of the things is if I don't get this new job, then I'm going to have to quit my job. To move to North Carolina and that means that when I get to North Carolina I'm going to be looking for a job then and that is going that's that's got me worried I mean I got skills I ain't gonna lie I'm a, I'm a fairly decent programmer but I'm not the best programmer out there you know I guess you know nobody really can say that right I mean who I mean I guess you'd be really stuck up and full of yourself if you could say oh I'm the best programmer there is well you know, I have no doubts about my abilities. Like, one of the things I've always said is there isn't a game, there isn't a program in the world that I can't write if you just give me enough time and resources. And that's the honest to God truth. Like, I could theoretically sit down and write any program in the world if I've been given enough time and resources to do so. And not just resources, but time, resources, and motivation. And that last one is very important. Um, and by that, I'm just saying, if I'm writing it for myself, I have to be motivated to get, to do it. You know, if I'm working for a company, the motivation is the paycheck. Uh, you know, just the fact that I'm making a paycheck, that's generally the motivation that you need because that, that paycheck helps you get everything else that you want, you know, get, get you other stuff. So that's something, like I said, I was a little hesitant about mentioning the fact that, that I am interviewing for another job, but because, you know, some people believe that if, if you mention it before you find out the news, that it, you know, you may you may ruin your chances 
by talking about it type stuff. And you know, I don't want to ruin my chances of getting the job. That's definitely obvious. Nobody wants to ruin the chances of getting a job. Um, but it is definitely one, a job that I am d dreadfully interested in doing. It's kind of perfect and right up my alley. And it's a really good price point. That's all I can say, really. I know, see, my GPU is like, oh, I'm taking, I'm taking. I just don't want to run across that ice, man. I didn't know that ice is going to disappear on me anytime soon. Like I said, I would much rather fly across this stuff, but I can't. Not when I'm exploring new chunks because it's got to create so many chunks gotta create all these chunks for extra explore them you know and while it's creating that'll cause lag and the fact that i'm flying automatically causes lag so yeah bad bad combination there ah uh, these oh extreme hills uh, yeah let me use the teleport spell whoa 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 whoa, 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 whoa. close the ding thing Oh my god, I am not trying to open this spell book. I was trying to pull up a spell. Dang these extreme hills. Oh, I'll break my ankle. You see that? I'm about to break my ankle. Do -do 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 I really do hope that we do find a jungle. I hope I'm wrong about this seed being bad for jungles. Like, isn't there a program out there that can tell you where jungles are? I mean, there's some kind of mod that can scan and pre-build all the chunks around you. That's actually what I need. That's what we really need. We need a we need a program that would pre-build all the chunks based on all the mods that I have installed. Just pre-build all the chunks within 10,000 of my starting point. You know, I know it'll force a huge lag when it first fires off, but once it's fired off, then all that, those chunks would be loaded, or not loaded, but they exist. Now it's not creating them anymore. It just has to load them so it'll be faster. That would be awesome. If you know of a software that does that, let me know. Or even if you know of software that that can tell me, you know, where to find a certain type of biome. Oh, look at all this gravel here. Extreme Hills M. Mountain, okay. I think that's mountain. It says Extreme Hills M. That's exactly what it says. Extreme Hills M. Okay. I like some F4 thing here. I don't know. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah. There you go. I think that, that shows the seed in there, too, doesn't it? Somewhere. Uh, X, Y coordinates. No, I don't see a seed in there. At least I'm not looking. I don't, I don't see it right off the top of my head. It, it makes doesn't make sense to me. Whoa. Okay, we do not want... I don't think we need to follow, climb up on that thing. We can walk around it. Chick, 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 chick. Maybe. Yep. Here, let's teleport to there. Okay, well, this looks like it's going to be back over the ocean we go. To lose, skip to my loo. To lose, skip to my loo. We got nothing. Do, 
How far have we gone? I'm curious to know. How far did we go? I guess we can turn around and look, huh? We are 7,000 meters. 7,000 something meters. Hold on, where's, where's my, 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 my thing here? I'm looking money. I got a... Oh, I thought it was in here. My, I have an application here that I can use for converting it, but I don't see that application here anymore. It seems to have disappeared from my phone. Yeah, it seems to have disappeared from my phone. That's just weird. That is totally weird. Found it. Do, 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 do. Let me fix this real quick on my phone. I just messed something up. As I'm playing and typing and playing and typing. Arr. Found it. All right, here we go. Do, 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 do. Now let's see how far we are. 8,092. So this is a distance meters not kilometers meters 8092 and we want this change to miles so we're a little over five miles away from the away away from where we started at just five miles And that sounds about right, I think. I mean, maybe. See, we went 20 miles in the previous week. But I don't think we walked the whole time. So I think we could have gotten further than 20 miles had we have actually been moving the whole time. All right, I think we can stop here. Pick it up. Thank you. We want to go this way. Okay, this is a beach, so that's gonna be water, so I'm gonna to have to float over this again. Dang it! Or not. Hi! Where are you going? Do 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 Ow. Seriously? That stuff's annoying. Hey, I wonder. If I shoot this out here. Will it land me somewhere? Nope, does not seem to. Oh, that does. Wait, underwater? I think, oh wow. I do think I am underwater here. I don't know where I'm at, though. Oh, wow. Something weird just happened. Come on, dang it. Shoot. All right, let's get a little bit of a view of what we're doing, working with here. We are underwater. We are underground. How in God's name...
Oh, there it is. Seriously, I want to go up. Why aren't you letting me... It was holding me down. It was not letting me go and jump up in the water. That was weird. That was totally weird. All right. I guess we'll just keep climbing up. Seriously? Why can't I climb up? What the heck? Oh wait, oh shoot, I'm grounded. Okay, I, I have that earth affinity. Oh man, this is not good, man. This is not good at all, hold up. Here, give me the overhead view, please. Thank you. All right, we're gonna dig back towards land, which I think was this way. Since we can't jump anything down here on the water. Stop pushing me aside. I did not realize that we were going to have this problem. All right, how, how, where are we at now? Oh, we still got a ways to go. So we need to go this way. And I think we should start heading up. My earth affinity is at a hundred. And that is why we can't swim. So right now we are literally just rocks. We're gonna fall to the bottom of the ocean instead of swimming. You can't jump in water, none of that. All right, here we are, back on the surface. Okay, so now we know not to teleport into the water. <laughs> that was swift. All right, on we go. No more teleporting into water, man. Ugh. We'll have to somehow increase our water affinity. That should counteract the Earth affinity. Do, do. All right, we got do, 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 do. Hey, buddy. Hey, you want to come blow up on me? <laughs> Like I'd actually let you blow up on me. Really? Oof. Oof. Do you see that? One drop. I can jump off that and it won't hurt. Oh, what is that? I guess it's just dirt. 
a certain type of beer. Tiaga. So that's Podzol. We don't have any Podzol. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to dump a bunch of this out. And let's collect some Podzol. I don't really know if there is is Podzol something that we can reproduce easily. Probably a good question, isn't it? Uh, it's dirt. Okay. So no pods off playing around with. Oh, we got some mossy stone there. Some more mossy stone over here. So this mega spruce Tayaga has mossy stone and pods off. Ticked him off, didn't I? He's like, you can't look at me. No. <laughs> do, 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 do. Back to planes. Well, actually, seeing that that that, spot, that new biome back there that we just walked through with the pods all and all that, that actually makes me kind of hopeful because if I can find that in here, maybe we could still find a jungle somewhere, you know? Because that's the first time I think that we've seen that particular biome type. So maybe it's just there's so many different biomes now, it's harder to find one. But then again, maybe it is one of those I have to go south to find it. Which is weird. Seriously, I get caught in a darn tree or a piece of grass or something. I'm just sitting there like jitter, 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 jitter. Oh my God, it's raining. Okay, that's something that has not happened here where I live lately. We are, we, we have so, we've had drought here where I'm actually, I'm talking about in actual life. We have a drought here and it's so bad that we have wildfires that are burning out of control like everywhere. Like I would never I don't know man like it's been smoky did I miss I missed dang it now some of the wildfires we have burning near us apparently they say were set by arsons but some of the rest were not set by arsons some of them were accidents or it, it was just I don't know what to call it but like some of them might have been caught set by accident by somebody just flicking out a cigarette and that cigarette happens to catch something on fire that's how dry it's been here like it, it just rained today and it hasn't rained in like a while because hey i don't wash my truck so i can tell when there's when there's a drought because when there's a drought my truck gets dirty and it stays dirty and my truck is dirty right now whereas you know it, it, it usually isn't like that like mother nature provides fairly well to keep my truck clean it's like we got something going on over there you know you know what i'm saying hook up mother nature mother nature hooks me up you know she washed my truck i don't produce i don't know i want to say i don't produce much trash but that's not true 
Uh, I, I still produce as much trash as everyone else. I don't recycle or anything. I know I need to. I know I should. I just don't. I'm part of the problem, you know? That's bad of me to say that, but it's the truth. Alright, well, we still have not found a jungle, and that's all the time we have for today. As always, a like, a comment, and a share lets me know that you care. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you back here on the next episode of Surviving Arts Magica.